In this video, we'll go over how to subscribe to DXFeed for both stocks and futures. Please note that Global or Global Plus packages are required for visualizing futures and stocks data. Click the link in the description to get these packages. Also note that if you subscribe to DXFeed stocks and you want futures data as well, a separate subscription for DXFeed futures will be needed, and vice versa. If you are already subscribed to DXFeed, click the link above to watch the video on connecting Bookmap to DXFeed. Let's go over the steps for subscribing. First, open bookmap.com and click on Login. Login if you already have an account, if not, sign up. Once you're logged in, click on Add Subscription and you will be transferred to a new page dedicated just for your Bookmap subscriptions. Click on the Add Subscriptions tab here. Scroll down a little and you will see the different options for the DXFeed subscriptions. For more info on the different options, please check the links in the description for both stocks and features. Once you check the relevant subscription, different questions will open up. Go over them, check the relevant boxes and fill in the relevant information. Please note that if you want to subscribe to NBBO for the DXFeed stocks, you need to first have Ajax, Nasdaq or the bundle. Once you're done, click Next and you will be transferred to a page where you'll need to select your payment method and then proceed to payment. After the purchase, you'll get the update on your license almost immediately. Make sure to restart your Bookmap platform and click the link above to watch how to connect DXFeed to Bookmap.